Botetourt County Sheriff's Office is using an old program in a new way. It's their traffic safety program, and they're watching to make sure that you are following the rules of the road. 10 News reporter Irisha Jones joins us live along Route 11 to explain how it works. Irisha. You will see if you haven't already more deputies out stopping those who are speeding. Today we took a ride along with the sheriff's office to talk about how they plan to make a difference with their traffic safety program. Travis Alderman has been working with the Botetourt County Sheriff's Office for 16 years. He patrols the county, works traffic enforcement, and answers numerous calls throughout his 12-hour shift. He's also part of the traffic safety program. We will have more presence up on you know, Interstate 81 in our county to hopefully slow down these people that are speeding through our jurisdiction. And it's not just Interstate 81 where you'll see more deputies. Also on 220 here, uh, the stretch we're on right now, this is a very busy section also. Um, you know, it's a four lane highway up through here and uh, you get quite a few speeders. Those patrolling aren't just looking for speeders. You can be stopped for seatbelt violations, inspired inspection stickers, and registration. When we stop a car, it is for a reason. We, uh, they have broken a traffic law or some other law. That's why we are stopping them, and we try to explain to them that we have a radar unit in our car. Although the program isn't new, it will allow for sheriff deputies to volunteer to work overtime without taking other deputies away from their normal duties. Put your name down, the times that you wish to work, and you come out on the days that you are off, and you would do it for that time that you selected. Alderman is hoping the extra presence can help save more lives. The Sheriff's Office will also have extra patrols on 460. Live in Botetourt County, Arisha Jones, 10 News, working for you.